today's video I'm gonna be showing you my go-to makeup look how to achieve this <laughs> and I'm gonna be telling y'all a story of how I almost got scammed because I lost my key in my car so um Let's get to it. What it do? What's good? What's poppin'? What's going on? Ooh. <laughs> so it was a nice, cool October 30th day. I think I worked that day and I had three stops to make. I had to stop back at my job to buy some cereal. Then I was gonna go to Dollar Tree. Then after Dollar Tree, I was gonna go to Walmart to buy some groceries. And I took my nephew with me because I'm like, instead of getting home, then having to call him outside to help me with groceries, I might as well take it to help me carry groceries inside because ain't nobody got time for that. So I was like, okay, okie dokie, artichoke. I went to my job, got this cereal, and then la di da, my car acting dumb. I'm like, uh, no, don't do that. Don't do that. In the parking lot, the panic alarm for the car was going off. And I was in the car. It would not let me open the, the car door. So I asked my, my nephew, I'm like, did you do something? Like, because that was a, the first time that I ever did that. And the first time was with him. And I put my key in the ignition. And it was still going off. I tried to unlock the door. I was going to open and close it. But that junk was still going off. I'm like, how you going off the key that in the ignition? Girl, I was like, mm-mm. Embarrassed. This is... Luckily, it wasn't too much people in that parking lot. It was night. Anybody really was paying attention. I was just like, I don't want nobody to think I'm still in the car. The car stopped. I drive to Chase Bank to put some money in my account. And then my nephew was just being so annoying. He was like, today at school, something, 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 something. He was talking about some other kid that was being bad. I'm like, boy, you bad too. You bad too. Like, okay. <laughs> but um, he just, he was just not making, he was just talking and not making any sense. It was just, it was just half the stuff. But I don't know how to explain it. He was just being super annoying. And I'm like, okay, just like a, just. Cool it for a good minute because like you just making me hot headed and I'm just trying to chill and just drive peacefully please thank you. I went to drive off to Dollar Tree. That boy was talking the whole way. I said what I told him. I told him can you be quiet for a while till we get there. That boy oh my gosh he was just talking and talking and talking and talking and talking. In my head I'm like I'm never taking this boy anywhere with me again. Like he's just so I get to Dollar Tree and when I get to Dollar Tree I'm trying to find a parking spot a parking spot that I want. I had passed some but I was like this is I don't want this one. I want a different one, right? And I'm driving my nephew like there's a parking spot right there, 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 a parking spot right there, a parking spot right there, a parking spot. I see. I want a different one. Then I finally found a parking spot. And then when I parked, the key was still in the ignition. And my nephew got out the car. And mind you, I'm still sitting in the car, la di da. Because I take a while before I actually get out to, you know, whatever. I've got to prepare my things like I usually do. And he closed the door and all. And I'm looking at this boy like, I know he didn't just get out the car. So I said, Micah. Like, while I'm in the car, I call him. And I'm like, get back in the car. Don't get out the car till I get out the car. Because if you can kidnap and you can snatch, I'm not chasing after you. I'm not chasing. I'm not chasing. <laughs> Do it look like I'm trying to run? Oh. Okay. I said, you don't get out the car till I get out the car. Because literally anything can happen. Y'all know this. Anything can happen. People out here are crazy. Okay. Ain't nobody got time for that. When I was telling him to get back in the car, I put it on the passenger seat, I guess. And then that's when... I get out the car, I lock the car from the inside, not with the key. And then I'm digging in my purse, trying to make sure I have everything before I go off into the store. And then I'm like, hold on, where's my key at? <laughs> where's my key at? Where, where where's my key at? Where's my key at? Sis, your key, sis, it's in the car. Yeah. It's in the car. That's a, that's a L. It's in the car. So I'm trying to open my car door. And I'm like... Micah, go around to your side and see if you locked your see if you closed your door right so I can get my key. And then uh, the, the door was closed right. It was it was closed right. So I'm like, dang, 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 d
ding, 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 ding. I call my sister and I'm like, I did something stupid or something. I said something. Uh, I locked my keys in the car. <laughs> Bro, I was so pissed off. I was so pissed. I was so pissed. And then. She's telling me to call my brother-in-law because he has, he has AAA, AA, what's it called? Some car service thing to help people, <laughs> help people get their keys out of their car. So she said, call him. And I called him and he was like, look, I'm not even close to you, so I can't really help, but call your sister. And I was like, I did. She told me to call you, chat. And then I was like, okay, thank you. I'll, I'll figure it out. So I called my sister and then she was like, call Geico. So I called Geico to see if they could help me out and stuff like that. But I think they charge like $80 just to get a key out of the car. And I'm like, no. So she found somewhere else. She found Locksmith, right? And then she said they have a deal going on 13% off, something like that, 13% off. So call them, act about that, and then see how much that'll be. Like, it's all good. I'll call them. And I'm like, so what are your prices? And they were like, oh, it depends. And I'm like, could you give me a range of how much it would be? And the guy was like, I have no idea because um, it depends. And I'm just like, in my helmet, man, I ain't got time for this. <laughs> okay, I don't. I was like, okay, um, he could send somebody down here. He was like, oh, he'll be on his way. It took an hour. It took an hour and 30 minutes. I kept calling back and he was like, oh, um, the guy is stuck in rain. Da -da -da. Da, 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 da. And I'm like, okay, um, thank you. He finally get here. Man, when I tell you his car was dry, you could see dust. <laughs> and in my head, I'm like, what rain? <laughs> There's not a speck of water on it. Just dust. Like, you go. So I'm like, okay, this man's a lie. <laughs> but I want to go home. I need, at that point, I didn't even care about Walmart. I didn't care about Dollar Tree no more. I just wanted to go home. You took long, sir. He parks, and then we start talking about price. This man said, $130. <laughs> What? I was like, um, what about that 13% that was going on? And he was like, oh, you saw that. And in my head, I was like, duh. Yeah, oh. Hey, um, she's calling me. Yeah, she's calling me. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> he was like, oh, you, you saw that. Okay. Um, and then he started calculating the how much it would be with the 13% off. But it really was not much. It was only 13% off. And I'm like, I was like, <laughs> I was basically trying to let him down easy. I was like, I know you drove all the way down here, but I was expecting to spend less than $60. What I should have said was, you took an hour and 30 minutes. I don't have that much money on me. I'm not going to tell that man how much money I have on me because I'm not stupid. I know if you tell him you got like $600, they go charge you $550, something like that. I'm not stupid. He was like, well, um, you're still going to have to pay me for coming down here. I'm like, okay, that's fine. But even just paying him $50 just for coming down there. He was like, okay, so how much money do you have in your account? I was like, well, I said, I have to pay like $230 rent. I have to pay $200 something my car off. I have to pay $200 something for car insurance. Like, that's three different payments. And I was like, and I do not have much money in my bank account. This man was like, okay, uh let's figure something out here you can leave me a review and it has to be a good one i'll even read it to make sure if you leave me a review we can make the price go cheaper and i'm like i said that's fine i'll do it and my head, i'm like i'll lie i'll lie i just i just want to go home oh oh hello lie shoot <clears throat> let's do it dang. dang this eyebrow is not coming out good at all i don't like it He's really bugging me. So I leave a review. I'm like, dang, let me think of something good to say. Like, I don't like to lie. I don't think I'm good at lying. <laughs> dang, this eyebrow is really pissing me off. Like, why are you doing this? I'm using the wrong thing. I'm gonna be using this because that's what I usually use. Because that be acting dumb. It be pissing me off. I see why I started changing it. But yeah. So let me read what I left. His name was Five Needle something like that so i was like Benito was a very considerate and passionate worker he wasn't he wasn't considerate at all because if he was considerate he wouldn't have took one hour and like 30 minutes girl i started timing like way after an hour had passed to see how much longer he would take so i think it was actually like two hours this man took long i was like man my phone over here dying this eyebrow is so ugly right now whatever i go have to do it 
Like, I usually do it fine, but it's not working tonight. What the, what the freak, what the freak? Panito was a very considerate, passionate worker. He made sure I was taken care of and came to me at a reasonable time. He had to know I was lying at that point. Y'all gonna get tired of me sticking on this one eyebrow. Then I said, after a long day of work, so you already know I was even more irritated. I'm like, this man, I just wanna go home. So I hadn't really been home. I went from work to home. Stayed in my car, got my nephew out, so I really didn't even go inside. I applaud this man for helping after locking my key in the car. I'm sorry God for lying, but I just wanted to go home. At that point, I was like, am I ugly or am I cute? Because if I'm cute, then I'll probably try to use that to my advantage. But I'm like, man, I'm too tired to be trying to... <laughs> so do you want to uh, drop that price? Let me stop. I'm like, this man really tried to say 130 for locking my key in the car. I feel like they really shouldn't be charging that much for just locking your key in the car. That's really messed up, to be honest. That's really messed up, considering people just got places to be. And if you don't help them out, and if you're the cheapest option or whatever, they really go be stuck out there. That's crazy. People really out here trying to charge. What if I wouldn't have asked about that 13%? Man, that's so crazy. What if I didn't keep talking? What if I had that money? And I was like, okay, fine, shoot, go ahead. I'll pay you that much. Get my key out of the car and give me 200 just for that. He really tried it. 130. 130 these nuts. The heck? That's so crazy. This man really tried to scam a little 13 year old looking girl. So I am going to be using a freak by Juvia. That's why I usually use like Aaron Murray. Watch your mouth when it comes to it. They'll say nothing. Slick. I'm using Cameron, Kofi, Fifi, and Angelique. I, I do the same kind of style. Like every time that I do my makeup, it's always the same kind of style. I don't really be changing it up. I'm basic. Yeah, I know. I should have did this. Y'all like, dang, this girl really don't know how to... Look, I'm not a freaking MU... A, MBA, NBA, CIA, FDA. Right now I'm using Cameroon. Just using Cameroon. Cameroon, Cameroon, Cameroon. Cameroon, Cameroon, Cameroon. But basically, yeah, that was the end of the story. They really tried to scam me over here. I went straight home after that. Walmart? What's that? No, I went home. <laughs> Ciao. I ain't paying 130 for nothing. Ciao. Mmm. <gasps> my wipes, I left it in my mama's room, so I'm not gonna go all the way over there. Anybody got time for that? I like to put Cameroon all over here, like a clown. That's what I like to do. I don't be wearing too much makeup. I be wearing a reasonable amount. So I'm using bat Bentu. What's it? Bentu. <laughs> for my eyelids. It's simple. Nothing much. Looking cute. How about you? A hey, bars. <laughs> And then what I like to use is, let me close this before I lose the top. Turn around for a second, you misplace a brush, and you're like, didn't I just have that job? Things be going missing fast when you in a brush. But luckily, I'm not in a brush. Haha. <laughs> I'm using a Profusion palette. It's from Claire's. It wasn't much. It was like $3.99. It was really cheap. But I like to use the, the black right here. I just, boop, tap to make a shadowy look, you know? You know what I'm saying? Don't worry, I'm gonna fix that side more. And I don't want it to look too right, right? I'll be just trying to look chill. Trying to be chill. Cause I'm chill, bro. And then I'm gonna use lighter purple pink type of looking color. Blue at right here. Blue right here. Blue right here too. I'm gonna use Fifi, girl. I was about to call my tear duck a water crest. I'm like, I'm thinking it's called like crest. That's what, I don't know, whatever, give me one. Close enough to water duct. That's water duct's cousin. I try to create a, look, I'm not a makeup artist, so I don't really know the terms like that. So y'all go hop off my nuts, thank you. Don't worry, I'm gonna blend that, cause that looks a mess. I look, I look, <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. But this is what I be doing for work. I don't really be wearing makeup to church. Y'all go take me as I am. <laughs> but I be wearing makeup to work cause I'm like, y'all go respect me today. Cause when I look 12, I feel like people be treating me different. So when I look 14, they have a little more respect. I really be talking to myself, y'all. Yeah. I just be having whole conversations, whole movie scenes, whole concerts with myself. Cause I am the bomb diggity to the diggity to the diggity. Time to blend that junk like a Nutribullet. 
Hey, and I'll be buying my eyebrow pencils from Dollar Tree. They really work great, but right now they work. I don't know, something wrong with me right now. I got my car in August. For me to lock my car out, that that really had me. I was like, dang, I just got this car. And I'm already locking this jump. Where's my little eyebrow blur? My blur, blur. eyebrow brush. Make that jump. Cool down. Calm down, soon. Y'all know me. Don't really be trying to cut my eyebrows too much. I just be chilling. Because my eyebrows bald headed at the end. I'm like, okay, if I grow my eyebrows, then maybe I can go, like, fake the eyebrows at the tip and just go, Phew. if it's long enough, but no. But you got guys out here with full brows. They don't even need it. You know what I need eyebrows for? The video kept stopping. So I'm going to do my eyeliner. My eyelash is so curly, just make things a little bit more complicated. <laughs> I don't have eyeliner for like the bottom eyelid. Eyelid. Yeah. So I just be using mascara. I just be rubbing it on the eyelid at the bottom, of course. I'll be going like that to make it a little dark. How do we? Always be doing faces like that. <laughs> this is cover girl. Ugh. I'm so clumsy. I hate it. Okay. This is cover girl blast pro flashy. Sometimes I like to use two mascaras at the very same time. This one, I don't know which one this was because it doesn't have a name, but I feel like it was cover girl too. Probably. I'm not sure. I really don't remember. I'm sorry. Sorry. Can't forget the lips. That's the best part. It's the really neat part. I love doing the look because it just brings everything together. Everything together. So then now I'm going to have to fix my hair. So it just snatched. So that's my go to look. I don't really be doing much, but when I do, I do this. Hope y'all enjoyed today's long, probably boring video, but it's content. So for those of you who are the ride or die, hope you liked it. <laughs>